What is up guys, Kevin over at Leg Bros coming back at you with another envelope day. It's envelope day. We have six, well, this is a box. Okay, I lied, I'm sorry. <laughs> we have six packages for you today. All Lego minifigs, all different kinds of themes, I think, represented today. We got Star Wars, we have some Ninjago. I think we have some superheroes in here. Um, uh, I think there's a Bricklink order in here too. What not order, mostly eBay. Yeah. <laughs> stores.ebay.com slash like bros where you can find this stuff some of it anyways uh and then obviously the links down below for athletic greens the p.o box whatnot if you've never used before ten dollars off your first purchase using my link down below helps me out as well uh which is always nice a good way to support the channel uh if you've never looked looked it up it's a cool app it's a cool app nice little note in here just has addresses on it okay <laughs> it says enjoy the fig uh this this is a little interesting. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> this was 73 bucks, and it's a very simple uh, unboxing for this one. Well, I shouldn't. I shouldn't have said simple unboxing before I figured out that all the bubble wrap was taped. I mean, I take bubble wrap too, so I'm to blame for this. Don't open my hauls on video either. I guess. <laughs> 73 bucks for a nice, quick. Uh-huh, uh-huh, there we go, Captain Rex. They said it was in fantastic condition, which it does look to be in. The headpiece is good as well. Love it. Nice quick flip, 73 bucks. Uh, I get about 120 for him, so not bad. I'll do that deal all day. Hashtag tings at the top. Uh, let's see what this one was. 30 bucks, this was an eBay deal. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, more bubble wrap. Okay. <laughs> uh, I, don't get me wrong. I'd prefer bubble wrap and a pain to unpack than no bubble wrap and mailed in an envelope. Even though I'm going to throw them later, that's on me. You know, at least if it's me throwing the figs onto the table and cracking them into oblivion, that's on me. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's not on them, you know. My my horrible reflexes. That's my fault. All right, all right, all right. There we go. Got it. This one looks like a Ninjago haul. Uh, if you don't like Ninjago, I got plenty more of uh, hauls today. So this is, we're only on number two of six. So maybe hit the like button and then skip forward. <laughs> You can only skip if you hit the like button first. It's just this weird YouTube rule. I don't know. It doesn't let you doesn't let you make scrub forward unless you've already hit the like button. So go ahead and try it. You know, if you don't believe me, just try it and see what happens. Like hit the like button first and see see if it works. Call me a liar. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. But you can tell what I'm gonna do now. I'm not even sad I dropped it. I'm not even sad, I dropped it. Fake giddy fake on that one. This one's real. That one's real. Little Zane action there. Uh, this one also real, great. We've got our money back, so that's perfect. Just with this guy, we're in a profit. Uh, there is Moro, that is good for 35 bucks right there. Don't know about that Zane. That one could be good. Woo, of course. He's real. I would not have said woo. <laughs> this is the uh, Force Lightning Jay, apparently. Uh, some kind of spin jitsu, air jitsu. I never remember what that one's called. Looks like the energy one, but it's not. We also do have the Nia. Okay, that one's real too. Wait, the body's fake. The legs are real. What? The head is real. The helmet is real. The torso is fake. What? What about this? That's real. That doesn't even make any sense. That doesn't even make any sense. Okay, I don't have to tear these apart. What? What? Okay. <laughs> All right. I was not expecting that. All right, Stone Warrior, let's get over this haul here. Uh, there's a ZX uh, Zane, not in a great shape there. There's one of the cooler Coles uh, out there. Uh, we also do have another Zane and another Lloyd. Uh, I'm going to have to investigate this lot a little bit heavier than I normally would. Uh, let's see. $97 is how much this one costs, and this one does not have a lot of things in it. 
Doesn't have a lot of things in it. $97 is what this one cost. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Look at this. Does not have his head, which I was fine with. I already knew that ahead of time. Uh, but I have plenty of uh, Rex heads. Just needed the helmet mostly. So $97, that's going to make another one of those guys. We also do have Cad Bane. Is he cracked? Is he cracked? Let's put his hat on, just so he has some dignity. Oh, he's not. He's not cracked. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Cad Bane right there. Hey, I just sold this Astromech. So this was out of stock until now. Uh, until as of today. There is a Mace Windu's Astromech, fantastic fig right there. We also do have a um, Phase 2 Grunt, which is a great one. And our old school Slave 1, Django Fett Slave 1 Boba Fett as a child. Uh, that's just dirt. I'll be able to clean that off. That's a fantastic fig right there as well. Two old ones right here. I think Dutch Vander, I want to say. Uh, and then a B-Wing pilot with that unique helmet. Not super valuable. Uh, and then we do have Anakin as well. Not super, super valuable. Those ones are all tremendous. What a good deal that one was. Uh, $150. This was the Bricklink haul. Uh, I don't know if they have a business card in here or not. I'm trying to remember who this was. Just has their name on it. I think it was um, like piece by piece or something like that. I don't know. I don't remember. I could probably look, but uh, we also, so what, what do we have here? We have some Buzz Lightyear uh, plastic pieces. If I go to a Bricklink store, I'm never ordering one thing, by the way. Just so you know, if you're ever looking at starting a Bricklink store, I'm never going to go there to order one thing. It's just, that's how I shop at Bricklink. <laughs> uh, if, if you have the cheapest thing, but it's only one thing, I'm not going to shop there, even if it's cheap. Just how it works. These ones are Mrs. Incredible or Elastigirl hairs. I uh, had a whole bunch of torsos, no hairs. Those are hard to find. Embo, look at that. They said the print was off, which I don't really see. They said it was like a slight misprint. Maybe it's just not perfectly centered, but uh, Embo, I will be able to make one of those. Uh, well, I don't know why this goes going in the thing pile. Uh, I guess it could. That Embo piece is super valuable. Also, our uh, Ninjago Overlord bottom piece. That's a super valuable one as well. We got, uh, how many of those? Three of those. Three overlords coming to you on eBay. Uh, some dark blue legs, some bluish or dark bluish gray torsos for some Ewoks, and a whole bunch of legs for some Rebel Frans. Uh, I was like, hey, those are cheap. Might as well pick those up while I'm here. Uh, this one is from my buddy Shore Store over on Whatnot. Uh, sometimes I just log on just to su support some friends, people who have supported me in the past, things like that. He was running some auctions, uh, things were going way cheaper than they should, so I bid on some stuff. <laughs> uh, try to, you know, worst case scenario, I'm driving up a little bit of the price so that he gets actually what it's worth, because if things sell for a buck, my friend Shore is basically losing money at that point after fees and shipping and all that stuff. Why did this get on the top? You guys are yelling at me. It's, it's on the top. That's for the digs. Stop it. Uh, okay. What do we get? Lots of parts and pieces. It was like a parts and pieces haul. And I was like, okay. Uh, do I remember what I spent? No. No, I don't. Uh, what were these? These just came with it. I don't... <laughs> I know some of them are valuable. I don't know which ones are and which ones aren't. So I have no idea. Uh, we'll put research, I guess, there. Uh, this one is Chirrut Ermway. That's a pretty cool one. We do have a uh, Darth Maul or uh, Palpatine. These ones are, that one's Darth Maul. This one is Luke. I guess we'll put these like right here. Uh, there is a Wookiee, like the Wookiee Catamaran Wookiee. We did get a couple phase two, those are phase two, right? Uh, episode three anyways, clone helmets. Also a uh, helmet for a Rogue One Stormy. We did get a bunch of these bodies, which are Cricks from the Mon Calamari. I, don't, I wonder if I have heads. <laughs> I don't know. They were just cool pieces, so I got them. Uh, and then two more Palpatines right here. That Palpatine's not particularly valuable. A Sith Trooper. We got some heads here as well, along with it. It was just some stuff that he was, like, cleaning out, I think. Uh, there's a uh, Obi-Wan, and I don't know what that one is. 
Commando, what's in here? This one, just some torsos, it looks like. Just some torsos. There's some sand red pants. Those are kind of cool. Uh, anyways, yeah, just supporting a buddy. <laughs> supporting a buddy. Spent probably more than they're worth, but I might be able to make something out of them. Uh, this one, no idea. If you uh, sold me something on Instagram or something, I tried to look for it on, on eBay and I didn't see it. So I'm guessing I bought it from some other source. Do I know what that source was? I do not. If I was an organized person, I probably would. But uh, if you know me, you know I'm not organized. <laughs> so therefore, it's a bunch of parts and pieces, it looks like. But it uh, looks like some good stuff. Where did I get this? Where did I get this? It's not, what, it's not a whatnot label. Cameron, if, you, uh, if you're out there, I'm sorry if I forgot. Shout out to you, Cameron. Uh, <laughs> parts and pieces, we got some old yellow Qui-Gon's and a clone. Always good. Uh, speaking of old yellow Qui-Gon's, right there. That helmet, or headpiece, is just the worst quality headpiece. It's always cracked or dented or whatever. Uh, this is one of the Endor Commandos. Not the Rex, unfortunately, but it is one of the Endor Commandos from the Tiderium, which is a cool one. Phase 2 Gunner, the original version of that, which is a great one as well. We do have Kiati Moody from the Battle Pack. That one's neat. Here is a Batman cape. Harrison Dula, no helmet, but there she is. Look at that from Rebels. Uh, we also have a Commander Cody. Perfect, just needs his helmet. I'll put a helmet on him, no problem. Let's see what else we got. There is a Ugnaught. Here is Garmadon in his jammies. Just a first order officer. There's Zori Bliss. Uh, we got Chop. The Chop Man, right there. Awesome. Let's see, Captain Phasma. Good torso right there. Uh, the Root Beer Astromech. We got BB-8. Here's an Overlord, not the valuable version like this of Overlord, unfortunately. Uh, this one is a Darth Maul torso, which we will take the arms off. That's the wrong arms on that guy. Ninjago Fig right there. We have a pilot. Just a Star Wars, regular generic Star Wars pilot, pretty much. Uh, there's an Indroid. Morning Jago Hunted, I think. Was that Hunted or Sons of Garmadon? I think it was Hunted. Uh, printed Legs. Look at that. Those are the good printed legs. I like those. Uh, there's a Chewy. Not much there. Bigs. And also the Endor Commando could be that one. We also have a uh, red episode... Or sorry. Yeah. Episode 3 red marking um, clone, which is a good one. The Scout. I don't know why I was holding that guy. <laughs> We got Leia in her Endor outfit. That one's pretty decent. Not ting worthy, but it is decent. Uh, there's a Knight of Ren torso. We'll use that for sure. This one might have just been parts of... Oh, you know what? I might have seen this one. I might have seen this one. Let me let me give you guys... I think I saw a parts and pieces haul on here. So give me one sec. Let me see. Yeah, 100 bucks. Okay, now I found it. Whew! <laughs> Hundred dollars. It makes more sense now. I don't know why I couldn't find that. It's like right here. Uh, it was just parts and pieces. Uh, I think it was like half a pound for a hundred bucks. So I was like, I was on it. I was on it. Uh, there's a battle pack static commando. Some heads. We'll use those. Anakin, Mandalorian, crispy Anakin. Uh, what else we got here? There's a rebel friend. Speaking of rebel friends, Yoda. We got woo. Uh, uh, he looks sad. I don't know why it's so sad. <laughs> There's the snowman helmet, I think. Uh, the snowman pilot helmet, I think is what that one is. We also have the red version of Newt Gunray's headpiece. A Geonosis, or sorry, a Kashyyyk headpiece. Sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry. Don't cancel me. Kozu. Uh, actually, that's a good one. Another Knight of Ren helmet. That's cool. That might go to that torso. I don't know. I think it's just a black head, so we actually might have most of that. Uh, those pieces. Death Trooper helmet, fantastic. Can always use those. Uh, there's a V-Wing pilot helmet. Ooh, an Inquisitor helmet. The original Inquisitor on that one. That's nice. Some more Ninjago. There is a little mini snake. There's a ghost from Ninjago. We have Suji. Snow Trooper, not much there. Uh, there's the Ice Samurai. That's actually a pretty cool one. Garmadon. Um, uh, that could be a good one. I always have to look up the Imperials, so we'll have to look that one up. Not 100% sure. Bomb Squad, Clone. There's some Boba Fett. 
Some Boba Fett legs, I'll take that. Another Rogue One Stormy helmet, I'll take that as well. And the rest looks pretty generic to me. The rest looks pretty generic in terms of Star Wars pieces. Not bad, not bad. Some good stuff up here that's going to go in the store and then be gone very, very quickly. So comment below what your favorite of today was, even if it's just these uh, gray legs. <laughs> you could say, uh, I really like the Cad Bane. I really like the Rex. This guy, not cracked. Probably one of the better things uh, in here. And uh, there's a lot of good stuff in here, though. So really, really excited about that. The Embo helmet. Man, those are so hard to find. Anyways, love you guys. Thank you very much for watching. If you're still here, true OGs, love you. I'll catch you on the next one.